Hey guys, thanks for clicking on this video. I'm so excited for this video. We're going to have my husband do my voiceover for my makeup tutorial. So we'll see how he does. Um, I'll see if I'm even able to identify all the products. But. Yeah, it's just for kicks and giggles. So I hope, <laughs> you, I hope you guys enjoy and Good luck to the hubby. Hello, welcome to my channel, Kendra Christine. Oh, I have my coffee here. It's very del Oh, okay, we're moving on. We have bare minerals, skin longevity. I'm just going to start. This is my absolute favorite, by the way. I use it every single day, and it absolutely helps my skin. I'm just going to rub it everywhere into every little pore. And then we have our rose primer that is going to prime your skin with rose stuff. And you're just going to put this on in a little dot and then a little schmear and rub that in, rub that in. This is a lovely blue that I'm wearing. It's absolutely gorgeous. Just tuck that hair away. Okay, we have the wet and wild. Fo it's gone. Wet and wild something something and it does things. <clears throat> and you are going to put it on like a tribal Indian. And then there's a concealer. Man, I have to read these products a lot quicker. Okay, so you're just going to put a few pumps, one on your forehead, one on your chin, one on your left and right cheek, and then all together now you're just going to smear that in. Boy, I look pasty white right now, but, you know, it's okay. It is the winter after all. <laughs> and, uh, okay, yep, make sure you get the ear too. And then you're going to just rub that everywhere and make sure you tuck your hair away so that you don't get it in your hair and you're just going to put that why are you holding it upside down why am i holding it upside down um anyways there's a another product uh not important at all another upside down product i love myself <clears throat> this one's a little bit of a, a a lighter shade and you're just going to put that right in the corner of your your eye sockets and on your nose and on your chin and, and you're just going to start gently just patting just just pat away and and it's all about the blend so you're just going to blend it in blend it in it looks to be highlighter i could be wrong about that i don't know my makeup after all it's not like i do it for a living and then we have lorac loriac lorac it's nearly gone i've halfway project panned this thing I'm so proud of myself and uh yeah so this is powder and you're just going to uh powder up your face and that's going to make it nice and dry so that you can apply the shimmering what in the world is this you're going to apply this stuff and it's going to go right on your cheekbones and <laughs> right under your nose just it tickles a little bit but uh, don't mind the tickle you just put it right on and all the way up here too eh so yeah, I'm just gonna just gonna do this and got to put on some makeup because my lips look a little bit, you know. They need they need some more life in them now compared to the uh, the the tanness of my face. Anyways, though, you know it's all part of the process. And here we have a balmy balm with a beach lady on it, and uh, and you know that's what I'm going for here. I'm going for the nice summer in San Diego vibes, you know, even though it's winter in Washington. <laughs> Am I right? Okay, and now we have uh, bronzer, I believe. We're going to just uh, do the same thing that we've been doing, just right on the cheekbones. Cheekbones go, oh, hey, you know what? We're going to do under the chin this time, too. No one's going to see there, but we're going to make sure that we get it. Also, my teeth. My teeth feel... I need to brush my teeth. Oh, I forgot something. Time to do the brows. <laughs> so I'm uh, going to darken these bad boys up because otherwise it looks like I have no eyebrows and that's just embarrassing. And so we have our 3D brow toner and we're just going to make it look like our uh eyebrows aren't painted on but <laughs> okay there we go um and yeah so now it looks like i have real oh <laughs> i'm gonna just drink this this coffee palette it is so gosh darn hard to get open by the way <clears throat> just gonna and do i need oh i chipped a nail gosh dang it okay so oh i finally got it and hmm, hmm let me see we're gonna go with a color it looks gold, and I cannot read the color, but that's fine. It's coffee-related. My lovely husband, Nick, got me this palette. Oh, wait. 
So I'm going to rub my finger in it. And then you're going to dab that on. Just dab that straight on to your eyelids. There you go. Don't be afraid. And uh, if you poke your eye out, no problem. So now we're going to go. For, we, we did a, a ooh, don't forget to tap that off. And uh, there we go. Do, do, there we go. So we did a, a gold tone. Now we're going to do a nice uh, red coffee, burnt burnt coffee. I almost need this palette so I can look at the names again. <laughs> Okay, so we're just going to blend that in, and it goes from a nice glittery gold that is actually very nice. Oh, so one thing that I was saying while I'm just applying this here is that my lovely husband got me this palette, uh, and he got it this year for me, but, um, uh, yep, just tap that again. He got me the, it for Christmas this year, although actually it was a little early uh, early present because it was supposed to be for Christmas last year, but he decided that eight palettes was enough last year, so <laughs> we stopped at eight. Anyways, so now we have uh, some more product here. Just going to rub that in. Not sure what it's doing, to be honest, but it's doing something, and it's probably blending. And, uh, yep, we're just going to keep keep doing that. And now we have black. Very important, so you're going to get some black in there. Oh, this is eyeliner! Yes, and so then I'm going to just apply this very gingerly. Just tap, 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 and just make sure you get that wing perfect and this takes a lot of precision a lot of skill and you only get it in your eyeball once every 500 pokes so it's all good there you go right up against and then you have the eyelash clamper and you're just gonna clamp those suckers down there you go per oh give it a couple squeezes why don't you too you you just gonna do that again. Just really, really, really squeeze them out. Make sure you get a nice big curl in there. And then you're going to yank your eyeballs back. Just, just pull it back open. And make sure you get the underside of the uh, the eye lid. Very important. You wouldn't want to miss a single, single strand. And there you go. You blink a couple times. And, uh, oh, we have the Lash Princess. Ooh, mm. <laughs> Gotta shake it up, because that's what my husband always tells me to do with these. And uh, make sure it's good and mixed. And then you're just going to pull away at the lashes, make them nice and full and, I almost said flagrant, full and uh, voluptuous and bodacious and voluminous that is the other v word i was looking for yes lots of volume in these lashes there we go and then we're gonna walk down here we're gonna get our our lower lashes you know and do the same for this eye really it's quite easy there you go nice and go oh, missed a spot okay now we've got a thing of ill focus it's the ulta beauty matte lip crayon and there we go, just what I wanted for these lips. Yes, perfect, actually, it's quite lovely. I'm gonna have to compliment myself next time I see this color on me. Looks quite, mm, mwah, quite good. Just gonna kiss my uh, my lips and mm, smear that around. Uh, fix the hair, make sure you get some wisps in there because I like wisps. And there you go, here's the final look. And give you a little 360 glance and a couple of Nice little stairs, and thanks for joining me. Mwah! So pretty, I am. Hmm.